Hello YouTube. We're going to show you our nice quick recipe for sweet potato medallions. You know everybody's always looking for something new to do with sweet potatoes. They're so good for you and really filling and low calorie. So here's our version of sweet potato medallions. You need four medium sized sweet potatoes. You'll want to peel them, wash them, pat them dry, and then slice them into quarter inch rounds. I used a mandolin slicer to slice mine up. It just keeps thing more keeps it the slices even and really does a great job. Just be careful not to cut the tips of your fingers off, but just get you a pair of Kevlar gloves and enjoy your mandolin slicer. After you get them sliced, you're going to need two tablespoons of olive oil and a quarter teaspoon of kosher salt. You'll drizzle the olive oil over the sweet potatoes, toss them, mix all that in well, and then do the same with your kosher salt. After you've got the olive oil and kosher salt mixed in well with your sweet potatoes, you'll take a cookie sheet, spray it with a non-stick spray, and you're going to spread your sweet potato medallions out over the cookie sheet as evenly as possible. You're going to pop them into a preheated 350 degree oven and they're going to need to bake approximately 45 minutes. If you like them a little browner than what I have made them today, you may need to bake them a little longer. Depends on how your oven bakes. If you've got a convection oven, they will bake faster, so you'll just need to watch them. But probably the minimum of 30 minutes in either oven is going to be the minimum time period. After you've got them baked and browned to the consistency you like, Take a tablespoon of brown sugar and a quarter teaspoon of kosher salt. Mix that together and sprinkle that over your medallions. Toss that real well and serve them hot. Hope you enjoy this recipe. We really did. It was really easy. It's nice to have those meals that are have a little prep time and you're just waiting on them to get done in the oven and you're not having to sit over the stove and watch them. And we've enjoyed this recipe. We will be making it several times more while our sweet potatoes last. If you liked it, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. We do answer all comments. You have a nice day. This is the Pressured Prepper, and I'm out.